we're gonna solve some 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 mysteries of the power box today. We're gonna solve the mystery. This is a dumb bit. Okay, once we're looking at a mystery power box. Mystery power boxes are they a scam? But <laughs> probably. But uh, we out here vibing. Uh, okay. So um, yep. So these mystery power boxes you can get. Five assorted booster packs. Um, vintage packs are seated one and five, allegedly. Uh, two mystery items, a coin and a code card. So we're going to open this in a way that it won't be spoiled for me or the audience. And I'm opening. There we go. Okay. So let's see what is inside of this not licensed product. Sun and Moon Guardians Rising, and we're going to open these as we go. Will we get any? That's... This is a fake pack, isn't it? Yeah, this is a, <laughs> this is a fake pack. Look at that. That's... Yeah, this is... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. This is a fake pack. 10 additional game cards. Got a fake pack. I bet this whole thing's fake. Cosmic Eclipse. Let's just see how this goes. There wasn't a reverse hollow in that. So yeah, see, Cosmic Eclipse, this is a sword and shield. Sword and shield, uh, that's whatever that last set was, sword and shield, sword and shield, sword and shield, and there's a reverse hollow. Energy, energy, pseudo hop. Yeah, dude, are these all going to be fake? Hidden fates. Oh, man, it'd be great if it wasn't fake, but I guarantee these are all going to... There's not a single code card in this. Three, four, five, six, seven, cast form. Mm, yeah. That one actually might be real. That seemed all... Yeah, that seemed normal. Still, that's at least two fake packs. Rebel Clash. Let's see if this one's real or fake. So far it looks real. There's no code in any of these though. So they've got to be fake. Yeah. Yeah, two energies instead of a code card. Yeah, fake. Or tampered with, I guess. Crimson Invasion. Let's just... Yep, no code card. So they've taken out the code cards and putting in an extra energy. Not even from the same set. I mean, come on. Just garbage. All right, let's see if there's anything else in here. There should be a coin, two mystery items, and a code card in here. Um, here's the coin. And the, it's a pen. Oh. Uh, same pen I got last time I opened one of these. Here's the mystery item. It's a black and white bear tick. Or is this, no, this is XY base. And then what are the odds this is a Sun and Moon, Ultra Prism, Checkling, Blister, Lowland, Sancho. What are the odds this is a spent car, or a spent code already? Pretty high. So yeah, that was a freaking waste. <laughs> I mean, come on. Oh, man. Yeah, that was a, that's garbage. Literally garbage. <laughs> Let's see what we got. Was there a single one of these? I wasn't. There wasn't a single code in any of these packs, so they're obviously all tampered with. But uh, and I mean, I'm gonna have to look up to see, like, how to find out if cards are, <laughs> like, to see if there's any fake cards or anything. But I mean, they all look normal to me. But yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I mean, I guess you live and you learn. But it's pretty annoying. I mean, come on, they put, they put two of the same, put too many cards in, and it's, it's just stupid. Mad stupid. 
All right, well, um, thank you for watching this, you know, whatever you want to call this. Um, <laughs> uh, I hope you guys are having a good one. I post a new video, like, every day. Um, stay safe out there. Um, buyer beware. Always, like, be suspicious when you're opening up something that is third party and not directly from Pokemon or a trusted place like a card shop. Um, subscribe if you want to see more videos. Hopefully you have not messed with cards. Um, I hope you guys have a good one. Stay safe. Fire beware. I love you. Goodbye.